hang on the BBC, mate. Albie Keith possesses the box. Jacko out, Tim out, and you just have to step in, right? It's a massive chance for Soham. It's a big save. There is nothing to lose. It's Bloody Lawrence. It's me. Come to a big game, mate. I know, I need the best for me. Put back into the mix. Overhead kick! All right, guys, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. I am joined by Seb, and we've said this so many times over the years, Seb. I biggest coming. Biggest game in history, all that stuff. But I want to put something else to you. Okay. Is this going to be the biggest profile game in our history? I would say the only game coming close to this, in terms of the amount of people interested in the fixture, will be the Wembley Cup, 34,000 people at Wembley Stadium. However, you've got to remember that game had loads of big YouTubers playing. We had Steven Gerrard playing. This is a game we have earned off our own back. People are interested in this game because of hashtag United. FA Cup, first qualifying round. We've already won two rounds to get here. Tonight we play Soham, who are the, the level above us. Um, what are we thinking? It does feel extra special. You know, it does have that sort of feel in the air, like Wembley Cup. I was feeling good about tonight, and the BBC was obviously a lovely touch. Great for the, I mean, our viewing figures are pretty strong. But, you know, for people outside the club to see us, maybe for the first time, is very, very exciting. But you know what's got me is the amount of people who have messaged me specifically today. I'm you as well, I'm so sure. Much. Saying good yeah. luck tonight, guys. Good luck tonight. It feels like, you know, there's like the whole internet, the whole YouTube community is behind us tonight. And, um, well, I'm very excited. 100%. We're, we're filling up here. We're at 300 capacity, which we've hit. Big thanks to the BBC. Shout out to them for coming down. Not just for us, but obviously for, for Sorum as well. It's great for both sides. Non-league football in general. It's great. It's great to see that they're doing that at the earlier rounds of the FA Cup. My last question too before we crack on with the video, Seb, is how important is it for Hashtag that we get a result tonight? Most important for Hashtag United is put on a good display. And I think a good solid start. Luckily for us, our boys are used to playing in front of a camera, used to playing in front of a crowd. So hopefully that extra added pressure should just excite them more than anything. For me, I want us to offer a good display. I want us to give this crowd here and at home something to cheer about. That's first and foremost, and I want the boys to enjoy the occasion. But Sven, I want to win. Of course we do. I want to win. Let's see what the lads have been up to before kickoff. I'm with the, um, with the bloody captain right now, because we are taking a little stroll to a little something that I like to call Ganter. Gantry is where the BBC are going to be filming the game from. If you're familiar with a lot of stuff from chapter one, I call it Ganter, because it's banter and it's a gantry, therefore it's a Ganter. Plan on the BBC, mate. Ah, uh, you know what? I mean, the hard work we've put in, it's only about time that we get to showcase it on TV for people. So. Right, look, like, are you feeling nervous? I'm not trying to like, you know, say certain things, but like, it must be quite nerve-wracking to play on BBC. You know what, I'm not, I'm it's not. It's just another game. Yeah, you, it's it? another game, yeah. I trust the boys, I have every faith in every single player in our squad and our team to do the job, so let's see what happens. So this is what it looks like. It's actually in between the two dugouts. Clearly, you can't be putting any big tackles next to here, mate. Why? Because they'll go straight into here, that's what everyone's looking at. Not my problem, mate. Not your problem. Not I like that, you, good boy. So I just want to take this time because before this game, I was streaming on Twitch, a bit of pre-match hype energy, okay? And Gleedy, let the people know the statistics. So basically, we actually got 720 on a sub train. Do you know how crazy that is? 720 sub train? But that's only the beginning. So basically, we've got 10,000 followers already. And we've got 700 subs, and we literally have got to 1,500 in two hours. In two hours. So we were at 700 subscribers, and we have reached 1,500 subs in that one stream. It was insane. Absolute scene. Stampy, drop the clip. Hang on, Schmigs. I've not seen you before, and you've just come in and gifted a hundred. Are you sure? Thank you very much for the bits as well. Tiziano's gifted a hundred. Tiziano's gifted a hundred. Oh my god. If you guys are coming at me with this sort of energy, I, you can't expect me not to just vibe it out. So if you were in that stream, massive shout out to you. Make sure you comment down below if you were in that stream. I'm going to be looking in the comments to see if you were there. We've got Rishi back here. Oh geez, assemble. How are we guys? We good? Yeah, good mate, really good. Got Jamel here as well. He's always here. We've got Harry here as well. We excited though, right? Yeah, buzzing, absolutely buzzing. Missed the last round. Obviously he was here for the first one, but yeah, hopefully we'll good result tonight. Jamel, what are you Sam? I'm thinking 4-1. Yeah. Ross. Aim high, take the test tie, we'll get high scores on it. I'm thinking, yeah. What are you saying, Ryan? I don't know, I'm just excited. Like I said, I'm so rich. I missed uh, Sunday, couldn't be here, but I was watching Spencer's uh, Instagram live for the penalties, and I think I was probably as nervous as some of the boys out there watching it. Um, but yeah, just expecting a good performance from the boys. Just go out there, give it their all. You know, win, lose, whatever. We're proud of them where we are today, so. Right. There's a well known fact that I've never been wrong on predictions ever. 
with anything. Ever? Ever? It, no. Like, if you follow Never. me, if you see what I say on football, you'll know ball. Oh, I don't follow you. <laughs> I promise. Wow. Anyway, 3 1 hashtag. 3 1 hashtag. Like Yo, it. Yeah, but no, it's, it's, it's not an opinion, it's fine. Oh, hey, what are you mate? saying? Hello, you got, you got the esports game, we've got everybody here, Yanni oh, here. Oh, look, repping the top. Repping the shirt. I've got a shirt on as well, to be fair. Why don't you just receive it? Wait, put it on. Wait, 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 I left mine at home, but oh my I'm, god! I'm the loudest geezer here. I at least you got a photo shoot on Instagram. Do you know what I mean? That's what we're at. <laughs> well, we say producers wise anyway. Not my influencer. Anyway, <laughs> we're winning three one tonight. Three one, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Two, two one, two one. Yanni, very confident. It's going penos again. No, Yanni. Oh, so why would he like say that? that? My heart's only just recovered from you the. You muck. Last one, and here we are. We've got Ashley here. You've, uh, we've been quite unfortunate with injuries, haven't we? Yeah. Jacko out, Tim out, and you just have to step in, right? Yeah. Jamie from me yesterday. Jamie Hersey, right? Yeah, Hersey yeah. gave me a call. Then I spoke to Debs after, and then I'm here. Here you are. Again, trying to help you out. I've heard good things about you. No. I can't lie. You've been to quite a few clubs. Too many. Too many, yeah. Too many. So I've heard you got quite a good little side tech. Is it? Is it true? Is no. it? Is that your signature thing? No. No. no? I, I, I like you though. I like you. I like the way you're keeping you humble. You know, it's, yeah, it's good. Well, Look who we've got here. How are you doing? It's bloody Lawrence. It's me. It's yeah. you. How are you? You got Very yourself good. down to a game. I had to get down to the height because everyone's getting right. <laughs> yeah. And you got yourself a shirt. I got myself a shirt. Yeah. I'm Very excited about that. I what size are you going? Is it the? I'm a large. Large. I'm yeah, not yeah, medium, yeah. but I'm actually a large. Okay. You know what I mean, um, I'd always say go a size up because you'll always grow into it. Well, I saw the hype last time online. I saw every thousand angles. Of yeah, the yeah. Thing, Jack, uh, yeah. Yeah. Jack mate behind the goal. Yeah. Obviously, Booge with the bin. Booge. There was James, there was there was a camera in everyone's hands and I could have probably mapped it in 3D. Um, but it looked amazing and I was like, I've just got to get down. And now you're here, it looks like some sort of stadium from Pro Evo with the sunset on the yeah, Oh side. wow, bang on. The bloody man, so he's going so for sure. Look at this. We ain't messing about. Honest. Get the big dogs in for the big game. We don't. Man's Spend dog, man's dog. Oh, shirt, dog shirt dog or something. Let dogs Who let the dogs out? Come to a big game, mate. I oh, know, only the best for me. Big game for uh, I wanted to come to the last one, but I, I had to go to a Thai restaurant for my little brother's birthday. Oh, that's fair so play, though. Spence, get through to the next one, because I want to come and see it. So we've done it. We've done it for the boys. We've got him in. The dynamic duo, FIFA Esports community. Beautiful, man. Got yourself, got yourself to a game, right? Got myself to a game. Uh, for, you, for those of you who don't know, I live 30 seconds away from Sound Town Rangers. So basically, fit on paper, you are supporting well, Sound. I was, I was thinking this, right? But then I started getting these weird cramps in my hands. I don't know if you get this. And then, like, the only way to remedy it was like start going like. Oh, hey! <laughs> Love that. History in the making. We're going to see uh, an FA Cup run. Hashtag, I believe. We're going to get to the first round. Cool. We get qualifiers. All the way through. Jeez. How are we feeling? Are you good? I'm good. I'm good. A night game. You come back to another one, but it's a night game. It's under the lights. The pressure's on me as much as anyone else because I am the good luck charm. Yeah. But the thing is, you got the shirt on, right? And if everyone's got the shirts on, it's the most important thing. <laughs> yeah. I bet on you guys. I bet on hashtag to win. I think we don't endorse it, but we've done it. Yeah. I'm, I'm on it. I'm on it. <laughs> I'm always gamble responsibly, but I'm on. I'm going with a responsible 3 1 win. Yeah. And number six looks pretty big on the, the opposition. Big, big lad, but pace. Very decent. And what are we today. thinking now? Well, I've just lumped on after you. <laughs> he just, he's just found a. Special things happen under the lights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Special things happen in the FA Cup. Special things happen under the lights. Gotta go for it. I thought you were gonna be going mental over here, but for a different reason. We've got all loads of money. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Where's the bin? Over there, bro. Where's the bin? Where's the bin? He didn't get a joke. He's actually asking for the bin. <laughs> I thought you needed to put something in the bin, but I realised that. No, you need to get the penalties. We'll get the bin out again. We'll get the bin out again. What's your prediction saying? Come on, hit me, yeah. This one looks a bit. I don't know. It looks tough, man. It looks tough. I want to go two-one hashtag for penalties again. Floodlights are here. The BBC. We're on the TV. Hashtag all the way. Hashtag ultras, baby. Come on. First off. Welcome to Ashley, uh, making welcome. Really appreciate you coming in, mate. It's doing us a, a huge, huge favour given the, the crisis we found ourselves in uh, from Saturday. Uh, opposition, expect them to be big, quite direct, and not particularly mobile. They play for set pieces, they look to go big on you. Us, it's a free hit. That's how I see it. There is nothing to lose. Again, you're playing a team from a league above. But you've really got to go with an intent to do it and not worry about what might happen, go and make things happen. But we've got a young lad out there tonight watching us who we all know really, really well. And he's a supporter, Callum, but he's a, he's a big part of this football club. 
in terms of support. You know our little band. All right, and you're like, he lost his dad the weekend, 16 years old. It's going to be tough to put a smile on that kid's face, but winning tonight will do more to help. And that's our little way. We can, if we can help put a smile on his face tonight, that will mean, that, that, that will mean as much to me as anything. So let's, let's take that out of us and give, give everything, yeah? Let's go, come, come on. on. So, Southern Town Rangers, what do we know about them, Seb? I'll tell you what I know about them. Okay. They're a league above us, yep. much like Felix Stowe, same league as Felix Stowe that we beat in the earlier round. Uh, they finished a few spots above them when the season was, was not avoided earlier in the year. There were three or four spots above uh, them in the table, above Felix Stowe, about mid-table, okay? From what I know about them, they're a very physical side. Okay, now we actually were told the same about Felix though, and I'm told these guys are up another level. I've looked at them warming up, they're very tall. How do you think we cope with teams like that? Well, we are used to it. You know, that's the, been the biggest thing. You come into the non-league world, at this end of the pyramid, physicality is such a big thing. We've got some lads who can mix it. Let's not get it twisted. We've also got a nice pitch here on the surface. So sometimes you could say, our team who are used to playing on this surface, playing some football, maybe give ourselves a little bit more room where that physicality can't be as dominant. I want us to get it wide into those wide areas. I want us to unlock the pace of Joshua Rasude tonight. He's going to be massive for us, as he always is. That's a key player. Obviously, George Smith, top goal scorer right now with four goals, all from the penalty spot. But we're adding goals around the pitch. Joshua Rasude is on two. Harry Honesty is on two. Jesse Wallassen scored. Lee Hurst scored. You know, there's been a lot of different contributions around the team. Um, have you got a name that you think we should watch tonight and we think it could make the difference? I mean, obviously, Josh Sude is one of the big ones. Um, I'll tell you a name for you to look out for there. We're both fully paid up members of the Simon Petty fan club. Yes, we this are. This is a man who's played at every level you can ever hope of. Played internationally, Spencer. The most experienced man in our team. Maybe other than the, the new goalkeeper, of course. Which I'll get on to. But Simon Petty. For me, I want you to watch and enjoy his culture tonight. I'm going to, I'm going to take a little step and uh, get myself a drink and watch Simon Petty. Simon Petty is playing right back tonight, but you mentioned it there. We have a brand new goalkeeper. Let's yes. be honest, we have a little bit of an injury. I wouldn't say crisis, but issue at the close, moment. It's close There's to probably that. four or five players that would be starting tonight if they were fit. Two of them are goalkeepers, Jacko and Tim Pittman. Huge both losses. Huge missing. losses. Devs has gone in the transfer market. He's got a keeper who goes by the name of Ashley Jones. Okay, a little bit about this man. He has played professional football. He's played in the league setup. He was in the final of the FA Youth Cup 15 years ago, 2005, with Southampton. He's been around the block. I'm also told he's a bit of a maverick, all right? So I'm looking forward to seeing what he can bring. Fair play to him for coming in and giving us some reinforcements. Shout out to Griggs, Callum Griggs, who actually came off the bench from the reserve team on Saturday, and he's on the bench for us again tonight. So, listen, there's a few names missing, but we believe in the boys. Let's take a look at the lineup Devs has chosen for this massive game. In goal, making his debut, Ashley Jones. In defence, Reese Schubert at left back, Ryan O'Rourke and Farai Singano centre back, Simon Peddy right back. In CDM, we have Ross Gleed ahead of him, Jesse Wallace and Lee Hursett gets the start. Newbie still injured, Sam Biles still injured. Ahead of those three, we have Albie Keith getting the start, George Smith up top, and Josh Asude getting the nod. On the bench, that leaves Callum Griggs, Toby Aroma Loran, Harry Honesty, Sam Rajgill, Joe Gregory. Tom Anderson and Nathan Joseph. And we are underway here for this monumental game. One thing I completely forgot to mention in the pre-match is the goalkeeper for tonight for Soham Town Rangers is Nick Pope's brother. The goalkeeper for Soham Town is the brother of the England international Nick Pope, who's also a goalkeeper. How's that for a stat? Backs off a little bit there. Why are you backing off? Why Chance backing here off? for Soham. Is that on side? That's offside. It's offside. Keeper's got it in his hands anyway. We love you, Ashley Jones. Really? <laughs> That's like legend. I <laughs> love this keeper, mate. <laughs> Boom! Here's the distribution again. Looking for Josh Asude. In the back. That's a great header from Josh. These players on the floor here. Smudger turns his man. Oh, he wanted just to slip Asude in, much like the two goals against Takeley. Anger back on the ball. Don't look back in anger. Lee Hurst unable to cut it out. Chance here for Soham Town Rangers getting the shot off. Ashley Jones, easy does it. Takes the ball. Ross Gleed now. Pass is cut out, but only as far as Lee Hurst. Looking for Smudger for the 1 2 on the edge of the box. Good interception from the centre back here. Well in, Ross. Gleed, he gets something on it once again. Farai looks for Jesse for Smudger. Smudger's taking a heavy touch there, but that's, that's promising. It's the right idea as well. Jo um, George has shown intent there. He's got the ball down. He's tried to play it through and get himself some space. That's good. He did, you know. What you don't want him to see there is looking like he's stalling on the ball and not looking like he knows what he wants to do. He had an idea there, it didn't work out. We don't mind it. Jesse Wallace to take this free kick. He's going to put it high. He actually scored one. Ooh, not dissimilar to no, that. No, he didn't. He maybe. I mean, that, you've got to ask the questions, Ben. We don't know this goalkeeper. 
Penny clears. Fry. Bit of arms there from the 16. He's oh, staying no, down. Oh, no, oh, no. We've got a man down here. Rip, rip, rip. We know not only are we depleted through injuries, we've also got some guys playing with injuries tonight. Um, and this is one of the concerns we had for Ice Ghana, who was actually subbed off on Saturday with a, a groin, groin issue. Groin injury, yeah. I mean, he's a big man with a big heart. And to see him on the ground like that, you know it's going to be something pretty serious. So... I mean, if anyone can get him going again, it's going to be Stevie CV, but we should have to see here. Reese Stewart, in the meantime, has made a good run. He's found George Smith. George Smith's going to look for Joshua Sude. They're going to double up on him because they know about the danger that is Joshua Sude. He's still got the ball here. Joshua Sude, it's a, it's a good tackle in the end, so I think. So they're doubling up on him, wow. When he gets the ball. Petty wants it on a, on a big run from right back. Instead, comes to Albie Keith here, who beats his oh, man. Now. Gets pulled back a little bit for his troubles, but he's still got the Penalty. ball. Got to be a foul there, ref. There's been a few fouls, I think. Reese Stewart's still got it. Can he whip it in? Looking for Smudger in the box. Oh, oh. and Joshua Sude tries to get on the end of it, and that's promising signs from the tags. Back into anger now. That is his name. Ryan O'Rourke. Oh, Reese Stewart weren't ready for that, but he does enough. Trying to find Albie now. Albie. Looking to roll his man. Oh, I think he's got him on toast, Seb. I think he's absolutely got him on toast tonight. Albie Keith puts it into the box. Look at the smudger. Oh, well he gets a toe to it. Much better from Albie Keith that there. Got a yard on his man. I think you're right, Spen. Once in front of him, he's definitely got the pace on him. But dangerous uh, counter-attack on here for oh, some. The, the pace this game's been played at is it's remarkable. Frenetic. The keeper's distributed it straight away. And now they've got us on the back foot. And this can't go on at this pace, surely. Shout out Lloyd Griffith. How are you, sir? Good? Legend. Hello. I've got to get that back off, and boy, that's too easy. Chance here for Simon on the edge of the box. They get the shot off. Keeper's ball, Keeper's going to come and get that all day long. Andrews there gets the ball. Comes back to Kelly now. It's a poor pass from Kelly. Lee Hurst it. No shrinking Violet in the tackle, which you love to see. Jesse Wallace has turned into trouble here. Jesse, Brilliant great, recovery work. Great recovery. Well done, yes, Jesse Wallace. That's fantastic. I don't mind if you lose the ball, Seb, as long as you show that sort of desire to get it back. And that is not what you'd really say is Jesse Wallace's stalwart behaviour there. Very good to see that he's clearly up for it tonight, Spenny. There's another big this. kick from Pope as well and this could go all the way through. The difference is now the ball's moving. They're already in there. Oh, and it's a free kick for Soham in a very dangerous area. Oh dear. Given against Ryan O'Raw here. So that is the issue here. That's their experience there and their size and stature. The ball comes in. They're able to put their body in such a way that either they can bring it down or they can basically make a nuisance of themselves and win a very dangerous free kick. So, big moment for Soham Town Rangers here. Can hashtag withstand the pressure? A free kick on the edge of the box. Going to be struck with the left foot. And it's struck very well indeed. And it's straight in the back of the net. And here's the number nine, Rogers, who scored it. Yeah, it's a good hit. I mean, from our angle, it's hard to see really what, what's happened there, whether there was a gap. It looks there he's just gone round the wall to the left-hand side spin. And in the back of the net, it is. We've got a bit of work to do here, hashtag. But one down. And we've not been under the cosh so far. I'd say it's been e even at a worst, even. We've got the ball in and around their box quite a bit, but we need to score. Baz going off. Baz right, going Singano off. is leaving the field. So this is a big departure, Seb. This is our second most appearance player in the history of Hashtag now. Only Ryan Adams has more. He's in the crowd tonight, Ryan. Um, it's a big loss. We knew going into the game he had a bit of an injury issue. Yep. So this is a big moment for the game here. And what we're going to see happen, are we going to see Pez move to centre-back perhaps? And we are going to see the young uh, Nathan Joseph come on for only his second appearance wow. for the club. And once again, what a, an obvious message to send out to anyone that's playing for our reserve team right now. Absolutely. That if you put, make some impressive, you could be in the first team, you know, some good performances within a matter of uh, days. We had a, we had yeah. a bit of a stoppage for Fry. Petty heads away. Oh, no. He's going to drop straight for Anger. Looks to find a strike. A good link up here from the Greens. Joseph Great. does well Joseph there. slides in. Might and now Anger's thinking there. about hitting this. It's a little fake shot. Well, he's going to find a man in the box here. It's a massive chance for Soham. It's a big save. And yes. it's cleared. And that is what Ashley Jones can do as we're learning. Smudger on the ball here. Send to Sude. Give him something to yes. chase. Go this on, is what he does. Josh Sude. Could he level up? Does he hit the shot? Oh, he might have missed the chance to shoot. Is it on his left foot? Oh! Reflected. He's still in. He's still in. Oh! Smudger tries a back heel there. Should he have trusted the right foot there? I think maybe. And the, the, considering the fact that he scored two goals from there in the last week, you thought he might have just tried to lash one across. But Spin, he might not have been on. But that exactly what we want from Josh Sude. The crowd on their feet here, much better from the tags. 
Curry into the box. It's going to come to Josh here. Oh, I'm not sure about that. But he finds Jesse, though. Only as far as number eight, Anger. He's looking to... A shot, maybe. Looking for a one-two. Gets it back, Anger, here on the edge of the box. No fouls needed. No great tackles. Man on. Josh, you've got to deal with this here. Come on, Josh. You've got to look after this ball now. That's not a bad ball at all. Smudger, what can you have do? Have one, have one. He's got a lot of many people around him. So he's going to have to see George do some work here. Perfect. He needs some help. He needs some help. He's going to win a yes, corner. Well, well done, done, George. Great striker play there, Spen. Held it up. Tried to bring some of his teammates in. If he couldn't do that, win a corner. Leedy's what do you think Leedy's, he's going to do going to make a run towards near post. There you go, look. Watch, watch, watch. watch. So they've gone high. Corner comes in. Keeper punches oh, it. No point. Doesn't hold on to it, though. Lee Hurst it. Goes back to Jesse Wallace here. Jesse finds Gleady on the edge. Shoot. He's thinking about it. It's not the worst strike. I don't mind that one bit from Ross. We know he's got that in his locker. So a few Malusners and there's every chance to keep a scrambling for that. Not to be this time. Look how big that kick is. Well, that's the half-time whistle. Hashtag do find themselves 1-0 down to a free kick, which is a, a decent goal struck by Rogers of Soham Town Rangers. Big team talk coming up for Devs. Fry out for injury. Big second half coming up. Don't go anywhere. Defensively, when they go and they go in big, we have to make sure. And when we've done it well, we've been brilliant at it. But there's too many times where we just switch off. And the seven in particular, it just goes. And whoever's closest to him has got to make sure they stay goal side of him for when it, it drops down. Breaking out, we just run in without thought. You're still in this game. Until they score, I think that's their first shot they get, the free kick. Then we panic. We panic and we allow them to get more possession, get more territory, and then we lose our concentration defensively and it takes a, a, a great save to keep us at, at one. You've got to stick at it. Stick at it, keep working hard. Your chances will come, opportunities will come. But when they come, we've got, to be, we've got to work harder in possession. Work harder to show for each other. Be prepared to receive the ball. Don't just drift thinking, oh, he'll play it to someone else and we'll see what happens. Got to make things happen. If we get wide and we get past the fullbacks, then that's when we've got to flood the box. We've got to get in there. We've got to get in there and attack the ball. And we are back underway for the second half here. One nil to Soham Town Rangers currently. Big 45 minutes ahead for Hashtag. And whatever happens there, it will only be 45 minutes because there's yeah. no extra time. There's no replays. If we can get it level, straight to Pence. Hurst with the corner. Leedy's making that run. Oh, yeah. It has gone low to him. He got there. But it didn't get the shot. Onside, onside. Back to Lee Hursett. He's gone low. Ah. Cleedy needs to make this. So instead, Clee Albie's going to make it. Hits it first time. Keeper might get Penalty. there. Oh, oh, well done, George Smith. Got there before Josh Pope, the goalkeeper. Don't Puts it in that. towards the back post. Hitter! Oh. oh, it's a chance there for Ryan O'Raw. And what a first goal for the club that would be. Good in the air. Had a good chance the other week against Takeley off the crossbar, if I remember correctly. Ryan O'Raw definitely got it in the air. Good save from the keeper. Sending it. Big for Asude here. Asude's done enough to cause Kelly a problem. Asude's got there. Josh Asude, can you get there before the keeper? Hey, you've got to say. done really that well. Got to give it to him. Very well, the keeper there. That is, he's learned that from his brother, Nick. Yeah, I mean, Josh does what he does. He just asks the question of the opposition, and usually he'll get there first. This time, the keeper's done brilliantly there. I'm telling you, this game, the, the pace is being played at. Keeper gets the ball, we go. Attack, attack, left, right, left, right. It's absolutely frenetic. Jesse to, to Toby. He might make this. Toby might make that. He's not so. Aroma Laren on the ball. Does he deliver here? It's a good tackle and it's a corner. Defenders recovered extremely well there, but that change of pace from Toby. It's almost a Sude like. He had five yards short of his man. He ended up beating him to the ball by 10. That's exciting. There's the ball from Toby. Headed away at the near post. Put back into the mix. Overhead kick! Oh, oh my God! Joshua Sude has attempted an overhead kick. It would have been. A hell of a goal, but it's over. I feel devastated for the world. There's just been robbed of the greatest goal in the history of the game. <laughs> it's so close to happening. I feel sorry for everyone watching. We've been, there's been, there's been a theft. What a chance and what a moment it would have been. But we go again. But he's only cleared it as far as anger. He's thinking about a ball into the box here. And he finds the goal scorer. Reshoot it, some defending to do. Great Ashley Jones save. with the save. Come on, Ashley, let's go then. Come on. Hit it on. Ryan sends it back. Keeper's, keeper's not come. Keeper has not come. 
That'll right. do you. Every That'll time the centre backs are asked to stand with their feet, they look very unnervy. Hewitt. Run at him. Run here. him. Toby, he's seen an opening here. He's thinking about a shot. He's hit it low. Not enough swaz on that. Yeah, again, he's, he's, he's a left footer, isn't he, Toby? So he's not, he's not a bad right foot on him, but you could tell it was not his preferred. He couldn't really get his foot through the ball there. Go on, Reese Stewart is forward here from left wing back. Defender's done very well to slow things down here, you have to say. He's found Toby though. Toby Aroma Laren back to Reese Stewart. Composure, composure. Well pushing back. Jesse Wall Lassen's thinking about a shot here. Oh, oh my God! God! Jesse Wall Lassen! What have we done for? Yeah. What have we done for? What a strike from Jesse Wall Lassen! The crowd have gone wild. Everyone's on. up on their feet. That is the magic of the FA Cup. What did I Don't say, ben? ben? What did I say? Come on. Have a bit of composure, boys. Don't force it. Trust yourselves. Jesse Wallace-Lassen, he finds the yard. I trust him. He trusted himself. The net ball, Spenny. Come We're on, back in it, boys. RIP headphone users. We will remember you. There is no extra time. There is no extra time. It will be penalties if it stays like this. I apologise to headphone users, but please, you have to understand, I've just had three hernias and I think I gave birth out my bottom hole. Come on, boys. I'm looking around, I'm seeing a lot of people that I know and love celebrating this magical, magical team that represents the whole of the internet. Do not give things up. Big ball towards the box here. Ross Glee's going to head that Look back. Look at that header. Look at that header. Toby, come and get on this. Smudger's onside. He's onside. Keeper's got to come. Oh, I don't know. I don't no, I think, know. I think I he's think... done well. I think he's done yeah, well. They know. They know. I've got to be honest. I think Nothing the keeper's done brilliantly that. there. You've got to call for it. You've got to call for it. Up you get. Push it. Yeah, yeah, definitely Hold push. It. Let's not give him that sort of thing today. Asude fancies this though. He might make it. Asude gets it across. Oh. Doesn't quite make it to Smudger. Get back in. Back in now, boys. Do the work. Asude, look at the running he's doing here. That's Joshua a fantastic Asude. from that Josh Asude. Fantastic. That is unbelievable. That is the development we've seen from Joshua Sude in an, uh, one second right there. Not just at this end of the pitch, the defensive side of it. The other person that's added that, that to their game this year is Jesse, who's yes. got that goal. Today Both specifically. Players. Yeah. So I'm really looking to get a winner here, and it probably would be a winner if either team were to score. Low cross in. Great the ball, challenge the ball, there the ball. from Tom Anderson. Toby, Aroma around on the ball here. Trying to turn one way, oh, goes man. the other, but we lose it. And we're inviting just pressure the on ball, now. Man. We're inviting pressure. And it's so I'm still on the ball here in the left of the box. Putting it back inside. Chance! Oh my God, my heart was in my mouth. My mouth was in my elbow. That half second where the ball is nestling towards the goal and you've got no idea whether it's five yards wide or in the bottom corner. It's absolutely agonising. Keeper, keeper, keeper. Oh, That's not brilliant, bad at all. That, Peddy. Let's go. Could be one of the last attacks of the game. Ross Gleed finds Toby Aroma Laren. Skin him, Toby. Skin him. Uh, it's definitely a foul there. It had to be a foul there. Good Toby. He's not given up. He's still in. That's fantastic work from Toby. Smudger's with him. Still Toby making his way into the boxes. The shot. He's lost off balance now. Jesse's going to go to Lee Hurst. Why? Oh, I don't know why. Lee Hurst is trying to put it in towards a Sude. Could be another corner. Corner, but we'll take it. The shirt's been pulled all over the shop. Chance. Oh, it's just not dropped for us there. And it's been cleared. By the way, Tom Anderson, I just saw his whole base layer then because his shirt was being pulled up above his head. Peddy to Lee Hursett. Lee Hursett's thinking about whipping one in. It's not a bad ball. It's actually got a bit too much on it. Bring it down, bring it down. Bring your man, bring your man. Go line. Sude, what can you do? Josh Sude. Turn on the afterburners. Uh, it wasn't a shot or a cross. It was just not great. It's worth a go, mate. At this stage of the game, you get half a yard. You've got to just have a bash. Anything can happen. Dreams can be made. So then I think we're going to have to go through this all over again, mate. Big kick. Referee's blown the whistle and we have got penalties for the second FA Cup game in a row. We've got previous. We know how to get these one, Seb. I mean, that has got to be worth something huge here. Two things. We've just gone through it, Spen, and we came through it very well. Not only did we win, how many penalties we scored? 13 out of 15. That's fantastic. Also, going for our favour, the hashtag United Superfans behind the goal. You would not want to take penalties in front of that sea of yellow. Third thing, Spencer, the goalkeeper. How many penalties has he faced in his life? There won't be many people on the planet that have faced more penalties in his life than Jones. 
Whatever happens now, Seb, whatever happens, the boys have done us so proud. We've gone toe-to-toe, to so toe, two games in a row with teams in the league above. We've beaten one on penalties. Now we're going to penalties again. It looks like we're going first. We are going first. And it's going to be Ross Gleed up first. Ross Gleed for hashtag to give us the initiative. Rostafa. Oh, Ross. Gleed! Score! Yes! Crucially, Sven, this time we went first. Yes. All they do say mathematically is an advantage to go first in penalties. It's Connor. He's a substitute. Was he subbed on to take a penalty? He was and he scores. He won all. Fair play. I mean, if you brought on to legal, take a penalty, legal. you've really, really got to put it away, haven't you? I mean, he has. Lee Hurst for the tags. Lee steps up. Oh, he's hit the bar. He's hit the bar. Okay. That's unfortunate. We love you, Lee. It's a great strike. I think head sometimes it's the way you've got to go in a higher pro situation. Just put your foot through it and he's just leaned back that tiny bit too much. Let's see what this new keeper can do. Ashley Jones, what you got in your locker? Soham, up next. It's a good penalty. It's a very good penalty. They put it bottom left. Two great Sing penalties so far for the Sun boys, you've got to say. Tucked in the corner, keeper's not dead any chance. And now Josh we see Joshua Sude, Spencer. Josh Asude, if, if we, if we need to score this, really. Let's, let's get it in, Josh. Come on, we believe in you, Josh. Believe in you, mate. Come on, Joshy. Joshua Asude. Good! Yes! Very good penalty. Come on. Come on. Really nice penalty from Josh there. Not too sure on the little run-up thing, but... It worked for him, mate. Take it worked it. for him. What we need is a miss. I need a wee as well. I needed <laughs> a wee this time, last time we had a shootout, so maybe that's a good sign. Or maybe I just don't go to the toilet enough. I'm going to call it, Ben. Andrews. I'm not sure he's looking too comfortable. Listen, Ashley Jones, we don't know a lot about you, mate. You're this keeper, you've come in from nowhere. If you score this, I'm going to name my child after you. And when I say score this, I mean save this, because you're a keeper. Jonesy, he's missed it! He's missed it! I am now three Over. from three. If I say they're going to miss, they're going to miss. Three from three. I don't have to name the kid after him, because he didn't save it. It went over. The worst penalty we've seen at this ground... In a week. That ball is still flying. It's just reached Ricky Evans' apartment in Dubai. George Smith, the man, you cut him open, he bleeds penalties. It's a medical condition. George Smith, I love you. Yes! yes! Come on! Believe in the dream! United. If he misses, we'll have a score to win opportunity. It's going to be number 15, is that? Come on. Russell, he's, got, he's, got, he's going to save one. Our keeper's going to save one. This is it, mate. Ashley Jones. Come on, miss You're it. You're a good egg. Yeah! yeah! He saved it! Oh, my God! It's he Jesse. It's Jesse. Jesse. For it's Jesse. Jesse. What a lesson. Jesse's a lovely name for a boy, Jesse. Come on, Jesse. Or a girl. Jesse, what a lesson. To put hashtag through to the next round. Conditions to dink it, Sven. To dink, dink it. it. To dink it. It's the Penenka penalty from Jesse. Oh, what a lesson. You know the scenes are unreal. The hashtag train keeps on going. And listen, if you weren't already on board, do yourself a favour. Get yourself a ticket. All it costs is a little bit of positivity, a little bit of enthusiasm in something magical, and you can ride it all the way to the bank. I don't know what to say. Jesse, what a lesson. You are, you're a hero, mate. Somehow we've got to pick a man of the match. I was going to say, it's gotta I, be think, Jesse. I think Reese Hewitt was fantastic today. He was brilliant, but we talked about it last time. The players that win the game, Jesse Wallalassen. He scored the goal that gets back in it. He scored the winning penalty. It is, of course, Jesse Wallalassen. We're going to dedicate that victory to Callum Glanville, who's one of our super fans, who sadly lost his dad a few days ago. And hashtag United, we're still in the, we're still in the cup. We're still in the draw. We're somehow still in the cup, mate. I'm out of breath. See when you're older, don't go changing. Well done. One thing's for sure, you didn't deserve to get beat. And you kept going, and then again, held your nerve brilliantly, quite brilliantly. So there's still more to come. But tonight's about winning, getting in the hat. But that, as a club, was amazing. The support out there was something else. And that's because you give them something to cheer about and support, because you kept going and you showed a spirit that kept you in the game. I'm delighted we've given ourselves another game to fit in because you deserve it. Well done, well done. Um, and 
Ash coming in in our hour of need and helping out, been magnificent as well. Brilliant, mate. Thank you very much. Boys, well done. Well done. Put your music on. All right, so I'm here with Jesse Waller Lassen. I don't even have any words left. Just talk to me about the game. Um, it wasn't the. I mean, the game as a whole wasn't wasn't the best. Obviously, we we went down quite early on in the first half, and then it was it was a bit scrappy throughout. Um, so the game as a whole wasn't great. I mean, obviously, cup competition, all that matters is winning. So we won in the end, but in regards to the actual game, I don't think we anyone will be that happy with our performance. But. I think the main thing is that you made amends for absolutely chopping me to bits at Wembley. You've done it for us this time. Uh, talk to me about that goal you scored. Um, yeah, just we didn't really pass the ball as much as, as we would like or definitely as I would like. And Reese just cut it back to me and I've taken one touch inside. And as I've struck it, the, their defenders kind of come across me, so I couldn't really see it. Um, but then, I mean, there was, the crowd was incredible and just everyone just erupted. And I, I, like, I've never heard a reaction like that. And it was just crazy. So I knew it went in and then I... I don't really know what I think I did a little run and jump or something. <laughs> and then the drama didn't stop there. You then scored the winning penalty with a cheeky chip. Like, what's going through your head when you're stepping up to take that penalty? To be honest, like, pe uh, penalties are, are a pressure situation. But at the same time, I've, I'm in the, I've got the luxury of the, if, even if I miss, we've still, we're still in it. So, yes, it, it, it took a little, uh, it, it did take some balls to do it, but at the same time, if I miss, we're still in it. So it's, it's a luxury. I think anyone, anyone, of, anyone else who have taken it would have scored as well. So. Mate, unbelievable. I don't even have words anymore. Like, my throat is, is hurting. Like, congratulations, man. Through to the next round. Thank you. Can't wait. Oh my God. Listen, this club is going to kill me, yeah? My heart rate is through the roof. I didn't watch the penalties. <coughs> I, I missed the first I lost one. My I lost my voice. I, I couldn't watch gone. the first one, bro. I'm finished. I'm but done. guys, if that's not content, then I don't know what is. We got Alex walking by. <laughs> She's happy, we're happy. Just me and Stanford being oh put for our places. We've got Neil here. Everyone's getting. Come on, no, like, like, we, we just can't handle it anymore. My voice is gone. But guys, listen. You don't know who we're playing. You know, next, yeah. like, we, yeah, Neil, like, we don't know who we're playing, <laughs> but the energy was insane. Everyone that tuned in, whether or not you're at home, if you press that big button, the big red one, or if you uh, was watching on iPlayer and all that good stuff, then. Even if you were here, the support was insane. And, uh, you know, just when you think things are just gonna keep on getting more crazy, they just do, don't they, really? Look, I just need to say one thing. Like, guys, I'm, I'm getting emotional right now, look. Thank you all so much. Like, you lot don't understand. You wanna know why all this drama keeps happening to us? It's because of you guys at home. I'm telling you now, the support that all the boys know that they get from the guys at home, from the guys who hear, here who show up physically at the games, I'm telling you, it goes a long way. So a massive thank you, because... These are scenes, bro, and I'm loving it. I usually use that period of time when Stampede or someone's talking just to think about what I'm going to say, and I actually have not got a clue. I, just I don't know face. what's going on, but make sure you guys keep updated with Twitter, all the socials to find out about the next round of the FA Cup. We want you there, because we're just, we're just going to keep going. And watch the social videos as well. Watch me absolutely losing yeah. my head and, and shaking and all sorts. Like It's, it's lit over there, bro. Go get us on the socials, man. Well, we're going to let you guys go. Make sure you do subscribe. Don't forget to hashtag it, and just, just we're just going to keep going. Peace.